Hello everyone, welcome back to Fight Age channel. Anthony Joshua vs Francis Nagano. Britain delivers a devastating blow as he brutally knocks out UFC star in second round. It was over before it really began in Saudi Arabia as Anthony Joshua pummeled his way past Francis Nagano with a devastating knockout blow in the second round. It was a much needed victory for the 34 year old Briton, who has struggled to find his best boxing over the last few years. This showing looked like the Joshua of old as he brutally eased past his opponent in Rydia. Coming into the fight, there was lots of excitement surrounding Nagano in what was just his second ever professional boxing bout. The French Cameroonian had made a living in the UFC, where he had been heavyweight champion, but the veteran fighter finally a change of a scenery and moved from the octagon to the ring. In his first professional fight, dubbed the Battle of the Baddest against Chinese and Beauty, Nagano put on a good show with the unlockers, surprised by how quickly he adapted to life as a boxer and by how comfortable he looked against someone regarded as one of the finest heavyweights of all time. This time around, however, it was very different. Joshua's power proved to be too much for Nagano. From the opening bell, Joshua looked to assert himself on the sports newcomer. In the first round, Joshua felt his opponent with a lethal strength right hand and instantly seized control into the Saudi capital. It was more of the same in the second round with Joshua coming out swinging and uh, Nagano struggling. A combination from Joshua landed Nagano on the canvas again, this time the 37-year-old barely surviving the referee's count. It was all but a game over at this point and just a second later Joshua danced down the canvas before landing a leather right hand which sent Nagano sprawling. I should be the WBC heavyweight champion of the world, a defiant Joshua told reporters after the fight. Nagano was gracious in the feed when talking of the decisive blow and made comparisons to Fury post-fight. He was quite special because he stopped me. He did what Tyson Fury couldn't do, Nagano told reporters. Fury Joshua is a fight that a large proportion of the boxing world wants to see and after this win for Joshua, it feels like it could be just around the corner. As a hern, Joshua's promoter seems confident in knowing who will win the fight. However, one knows he knocks out Tyson Fury, I've always believed it and now it's not even questionable. He even told Sky Sports after the fight. Francis Nagano dusted himself off to attend last night's post-fight press conference after his second round knockout loss to Anthony Joshua. The Cameroonian UFC star was down three times in all against rampant Joshua, who lined Nagano up for several chilling right hands before emphatically closing the show. Sportingly, Nagano said, I was just on my way, climbing up the boxing ladder, until I got stopped by AJ. Congratulations, by the way, this was a clean one. He and Joshua sat side by side, talking to the media. Last October, Nagano dropped Tyson Fury and took him to the wire in a 10-rounder, but there were no such heroics last night as Joshua laid him out in spectacular fashion. He was quite special because he stopped me, admitted Nagano. He did what Tyson Fury could do, it wasn't my day, he is just way better than me today. It's an aspect of the game, we know that. It was not to be told that does not mean Nagano is throw with boxing. Right now I think I'm going to go home, get some rest, process what happening, added Nagano. This has been a hell of a day. Since this morning, I will process it and see what is the next step. Maybe MMA, but you can be sure that I am not done here. I'm not done. Nagano said. Thanks for watching, guys. If you like this video, please subscribe to my YouTube channel.